Hello, this is Azad Hussain again. Hope you have completed all the activities in modules 2 and 3 and ready to start module 4. Here is our lesson map for module 4. Please take a look at the lesson map to know about the learning outcomes from this module. As you can see in module 4, you will be introduced with a new topic that is eigenvalues and eigenvectors. It covers selected parts of chapter 8 of our textbook. We will cover the materials in sections 8.1 and 8.2. After the successful completion of this module, you will gain some understanding of the eigenvalues and the associated eigenvectors and their applications. Specifically, you will be able to calculate the eigenvalues and the associated eigenvectors for both 2x2 two two and 3x3 three three matrices. Know how to handle conditions with repeated eigenvalues. Given a possible eigenvector of a matrix, know how to determine whether it is an eigenvector and how to calculate the associated eigenvalue. Now, as we saw in the previous modules, there are five components of learning activities. Number one, reading selected sections from your textbook, that is sections 8.1 and 8.2. Number two, watching provided videos for both lecture slides and example problems. Number three, understanding the example problems. Number four, solving the recommended homework problems. And five, attending the on-campus in-person health session. As always, remember you have to participate actively in all these five activities to achieve the learning outcomes from this module and perform well in the quizzes and exams as well. Now here you can see the list of the assessments that uh, we will have for this module. I'm sure you all already know about this from the previous modules and the course syllabus. However, please note that you may have multiple questions from this module in exam 1 and also in the final exam. Good luck. Bye for now.